The Surani sisters, Zoya, Sara, and Sahirish, created a peer education program to reduce obesity among young kids in 60% Latino Corpus Christi, Texas. When Men's Health released the article that called Corpus Christi the fattest city in America, my mom was just like, See, it's true. If something's not done, then this can happen to us too. We wanted to help make a difference and shed the name of, from our community. So when we were researching, we realized that there were obesity and diabetes preventions out there. Students develop habits by the age of five. And we found that if we were gonna go to students and educate them about diabetes, obesity, and healthy lifestyle choices, and we did it after the age of five, it wouldn't be worth it because we would be trying to change habits, which is a lot harder than creating habits. The Sudani sisters already created educational programs for kids through their parents' It's Your Life Foundation. One program showed families how to avoid tobacco. Another taught teens the benefits of sleep, what could they do for obesity? So we thought of a program called I Conquer. We realized that children our age, if we taught younger children, they would listen to us because they would look at us like role models. So we decided that our program would be high school students teaching elementary and preschool children. They envisioned weekly sessions to teach health using music videos, cartoons, dances, puppet shows, and eye clicker tests where kids choose between pictures of healthy or unhealthy items. With a plan in mind, they formed a volunteer group. Initially, our project started with um, three co-founders, and we expanded to three more to get new ideas and initially develop the initial resources. Next, they had to create educational resources. So we had volunteers as well as a mission and a vision, but we really didn't have funding to know how to create the sources. We applied for grants, um, and the grant writing process was a learning experience. Mom and Dad helped um, write and formulate how a proper grant should be written. They got several grants. They also reached out to the Corpus Christi School District, which allowed the sisters to present I Conquer at a local event, where 46 coaches signed up to get the program. They also got support from the local mayor, fitness council, school board, and superintendent. The sisters did their first I Conquer presentation at Jaeger Elementary in 2013. Um, we did a lot of dancing. We did eat apples and a lot of healthy stuff. They're able to develop these better habits for themselves. They see that, oh, these are high school kids, and I want to be just like that. Since the project's inception, we've been to over 36 schools, including Head Start programs, but a lot of the, these schools we visit every year. And we've targeted over 20,000 students through health fairs, elementary schools. Being there and educating these children is so fun because when we leave, they want to know when we're coming back. They also created maps for parents of local places to find healthy food. Sometimes children think that junk food is yummy, but it's bad. But when we give them fruits and vegetables and exercises that are fun and yummy and healthy, they get very, very happy. Our motivation for I Conquer is bound by that happiness because when they're happy, we also become happy. 